Good morning, class. We're going to be doing things a little different today. Uh, just like you, I am not at school. I am outside. You could be indoors or you could be outdoors. Um, so we're going to be running things a, uh, differently today. Uh, like we usually start, we're going to start with our word of the day. Our word of the day is more. And if you want to flip to your voice, I want you to point to the word more. You can either point to the word more, you could say more, or you can sign more, however you prefer. As we go through the book, more work, more fun, when we come to the word more, I would like you to point to the word more in your voice, I'd like you to say it, or I would like you to sign it, either way works. More work, more fun. There is always more work to do on the farm. More animals to care for. More planting. More weedy. More raking. And more harvesting. There is always more work to do on the farm. And there is always more fun here too. week is more. And this is a good book because we are now in spring. And springtime is when we do a lot of planting, a lot of gardening. We get outdoors. Now what I'd like you guys to do is open your voice to the days of the week. day is it today? I wonder what it is. Let's take a look. Today is Monday. If today is Monday, and we're going to put that on our days of the week chart, today is Monday. us to think about what was yesterday. So we're going to go back a day. So let's look on our calendar. If today's Monday, let's go back a day. What was yesterday? Yesterday was Sunday. You're right. Good job. So we're going to put yesterday was Sunday. Now if we look, if yesterday was Sunday, today is Monday, what will tomorrow be? What will tomorrow be? We're going to jump forward a day. What will it be? You're right. Tomorrow will be Tuesday. Good job, guys. Tuesday. Tomorrow will be Tuesday. So if today is Monday, we need to come down to our calendar and look. Uh-oh, we don't have the right day on there. So let's turn to our days of the week and find out what day tomorrow will be. The day is the number it is on. If yesterday was the 22nd, what will today be? The 23rd? You're right. It is the 23rd today. So we're going to put that there. So today is Monday the 23rd. But what month is it? we got to look at what month it is. So let's turn to your months and your voice. We know that it's Monday. 
we know that it's the 23rd. But what month is it? So let's look. You're right. It is the month of March. So it is March 23rd. Let's count how many days we've been in March starting with one. Ready? Begin. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, and 23. March 23rd. Good job, guys. Now let's turn our voice to the weather. If you're outside, I just want you to look into the sky and look around you. If you're indoors, go to a window and look outside. What does it look like to you at your house? Is it sunny? Is it cloudy? Is it raining or snowing? You decide. After, I want you to think, how does it feel? Is it cold? Is it cool? Is it hot or is it warm? Where I'm at, There's some sun in the sky. But there's also clouds. In the early morning, it's chilly and it's cool. And that's how I feel today. And we could both have a sunny and cloudy day and it can still be cool, but it might feel warm to you. To me and my spot, it's sunny, cloudy, and cool. Yours could be different, and that's okay. Now we're going to look up and look at the season. Since you've been gone, it changed. Before we left for break, it was winter. It is now spring. Springtime. And if you look around, you're going to see what happens in spring. You can pan around. Flowers start blooming. Birds are out. The bees are pollinating. All things that happen in springtime. And so that's a fun time of year. And since it's spring and it's sunny cloudy, and there could be rain, let's dress our friend Joey. How should he dress? Hmm. Thinking, thinking. I wonder if he should have shorts. Where I'm at, it's cool. Probably not a good idea. So let's find pants. There they are. Joey's got pants on. Still supposed to rain. I wonder what he should wear on the top. Should it be a tank top? I think he might need sleeves. So let's put him in a t-shirt for now. It's not raining yet. What about his feet? How should we cover his feet? Should he wear flippy floppies? Or should he wear boots? I think Joey should wear boots. 
Don't want his feet to get cold. How about a hat? Should he wear a hat? What do you think? Should he wear a hat? I think he should wear a hat. I think a ball cap will work fine. Any baseball players out there? Weston, you? Are you a baseball player? How about gloves? Might be chilly. We should probably cover his little paws up. Put some gloves on him. Do you think Joey's dressed for the weather properly? For my area, yes. Yours might be different and that's okay. So Joey is dressed. We'll keep him right there. Goodbye, everyone. Hope you enjoyed this circle time out in the outdoors and enjoy your spring. And we look forward to seeing you soon.